Hello everyone, welcome back to class. Before we start today's subject, let's take our minds over again. Let's start with the elephant. An elephant walks like this, like that. He's terribly big and terribly fat. He has no fingers, he has no toes. But goodness gracious, what a nose. Great job, guys. Dr. Foster. Dr. Foster went to Gloucester in a shower of rain. He stepped in the puddle right up to his middle and never went back again. Good job, guys. One more, one more. Hey, diddle, diddle, the cat and the fiddle, the cow jumped over the moon. The little dog loved to see such sport and the dish and the with the spoon. Great job, guys. Well done. Roll it for yourself. Roll and let it go. One, two, three, four, five. You are awesome. Good job, guys. Well done. So today we're going to be looking at our room numeracy. Okay? Our mathematics. Now for our numeracy, we're going to be doing patterns. Now, patterns are just things that repeat or occur over and over and over again until you make a very beautiful design. Okay, guys? I said patterns are things that keep happening over and over again until you get a beautiful design. So, we're going to be doing patterns. We're going to be creating and growing our patterns longer and bigger until they give us a beautiful design. So I have Legos here, so I'm going to be making my patterns first with Legos. I have different colors of Legos here. So let me just create the first pattern. So I'm going anyway. Okay. Okay, so this is the first pattern I want to create. Red, green, yellow. Red, green, yellow. So which one should come next? Red, green, yellow. Which one should come next? Which one? The red one! Good job, guys! Good job! We're growing this pattern. So I have red, green, yellow, red. Which one comes next? Which one comes next? Which one comes next? Green! Good job! So I have red, green, yellow, red, green. Which one comes next? Yellow! Well done, guys! And you keep growing the pattern over and over again when it keeps, keeps growing, okay? So I'm going to just drop my Legos, take them away by Legos. Now, I want to make a pattern with numbers. I want to make a pattern with numbers, okay? So I have a couple of numbers here. I'm just going to move my Legos and arrange my numbers. Okay, guys, so I have a couple of numbers here, mainly five and two. Mainly five and two. Okay, so let's start. So I want to make, um, I want to start from, let's see which one is that I should ask. Two, three, four, five. So I have two, five, two, five. Which one should come next? I have two, five. I have two, five, two, five. So which one should come next? Which should come next? Two, five, two, five, two. Good job, guys. Well done. Well done. We're growing this pattern gradually. Two, five, two, five, two, five. Good job, guys. Well done. Can we make a pattern with numbers and cups? Do you think we can do that? Let's try. So I just move my numbers away again. One minute. Okay. Let me see if I can create this. Okay. So I have this, I have this, okay, I'm going to do this, okay, okay, so I have five, two, cup, five, two, cup, so which one should come next, 
Five, two, come. Which one should come next? Five, good job. Can we do this faster now? Five, two, cup, five, two. Good job, guys. One more. Let's break one more. Five, two, cup, five, two, cup. Good job, guys. Well done. Now, you see, you can make patterns with anything around you. If you look at my hair, my hair is a beautiful pattern. Do you see that? Black, white, black, white, black, white, black, white. It's a pattern. You can make patterns with anything around you and it develops into a beautiful design. So good luck learning your patterns. Good luck growing those patterns. Have fun learning your patterns. See you in the next class.